The <laughs> rain that we've been tracking the past couple of hours coming down pretty good in spots, but really fading. Here's the last hour, and I want you to notice this line going from west to east, still slowly sagging south, but notice it's really falling apart. And so we'll keep the chance for a few light showers in there the next hour, maybe a little bit less than that, but it's really not amounting to much. What has happened, some rain cooled air. Anywhere that's gotten some decent rain, you've seen numbers fall and fall fast. How about 67 right now in Pontiac, also that in Howell. All this with a boundary that's slowly sagging south, and that boundary is pushing the muggy air out of here. Dew points are in the 50s further north. That's the dry air. So all this dry air is slowly working its way in the next couple of hours. Again, setting the stage for a great weekend ahead. High pressure to our north, and that means lots of sunshine for us this weekend. Any rain out there the next hour, again, should fade away by 7, maybe 8 o'clock at the latest. We're drying out and clearing things out as we start your Saturday. Lots of sunshine, a couple of high clouds drifting by during the afternoon, but that's about it. If you have plans to be out this weekend, two thumbs up. Very pleasant. Not only is the drier air in place, but temperatures are going to be below normal. Upper 70s on Saturday, low 80s on Sunday, a couple of good golfing days. Now next week, the heat does return. It's not just that, but it's also the humidity. So even though that high temperature is going to be in the upper 80s on Monday, it's going to feel more like 90. With the heat and the humidity comes another chance for rain. You'll see it in the seven day. Low 60s tonight, upper 50s in some of the suburbs with again that rain coming to an end, clouds breaking. Winds are still a little bit high and those winds will stay breezy tomorrow. So if you're going to be out, just be mindful of that. Keep your hat on upper 70s. That's about six degrees below or rather five degrees below where we should be this time of the year. But with lots of sunshine, really no complaints. Again, still going to be a touch of breezy on your Saturday. Sunday looking nice as well. Lots of sun will do a notch better 82 for the high, but it's next week that the heat really starts to build in. Like I mentioned, we'll be close to 90 for a heat index on Monday, so the muggies are back. Tuesday showers are expected mainly early in the morning, and there could be a few rumbles of thunder there as well. Wednesday, a few lingering showers as well. Thursday, Friday looks a lot better with more sunshine returning temperatures much more bearable as well. Don't forget the local forecasters app. You can download it and track any rain this evening. And if you have any weekend plans, some good things on there as well.